like get punks full out is not trash. Why is Kong Skull Island not trash? Holy shit, dude. Larry Fong, the cinematographer, every single shot. I'm talking like character establishing shots where you see Samuel Jackson's character the first time, so fucking beautiful. And there's a motif of his character. It's like anything related to fire, sparks, destruction, it's there right in his first shot. They're like in a warehouse and there's like some welding like light, like, you know, sparks coming down. And that's what you see with that character. And then later on, holy shit, dude. And then like you have like fire in their eyes like the so it's weird right like as a cinematic universe this like monster titan verse it's not a good one right godzilla 2 shit first one the thing about the first one right is it's like it's hella grounded it's like really up its own ass about trying to be like gritty but like that's the thing about Kong, right? Is it's so much better because it's like, nah, 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 nah. We are not like gritty soldier shit, right? We are like full into the like, we're going into Skull Island. We're all like fucking like show it for all its glory. And we don't have to fucking be like, oh, well, you know, just nuclear tests and this could explain this. No, no, no. We're going deep into it. You know what I mean? And the visual language presented by Larry Fong shows that, right? Um, the slow-mo shots, I mean, he's the one from 300, right? This is a man who was, like, fucking film school buddies with Zack Snyder. So you have, like, constant, like, zoom-in shots, fucking slow-mo, and it really benefits the, like, titan nature to where we're not doing the whole peekaboo shit from the first Godzilla, you know what I mean? Um, and I, I like magic a lot. I think I've done magic since I was a kid, and I think that maybe uh, affects how I do my job because I can think outside the box and you know, if we do this and this it might be really easy to make it look like this because film is all visual right and magic is visual so it's making things look like something that maybe aren't really happening so to me magic and film are intertwined so to wrap it all up Larry Fong every it's something that just goes through the entire movie and there's something so beautiful about it that distances itself from that like gritty nature of the first Godzilla movie which is like there will be times where they'll like, when you're in the moment of fucking Loki with the samurai sword and he's hacking and slashing through uh, fucking, you know, pterodactyl babies, we don't fucking like, it doesn't look like your cell phone footage, right? The color and the gain is boosted, everything is very stylized and it, it's more about the feeling of seeing a badass like Loki hack and slash through pterodactyls than it is just like seeing someone swing a sword right it's about the feeling of a badass not the actual what a badass would look like and that that is why kong skull island is not trash at least